Let the flames hit the pot. Let the water start boiling and give me that soda that you got. Pass the dope and start it cooking. That's my junkies on my block. Nigga be running everywhere Since because you know the block is full of cuss. Give me your money, give me your brain. Call me the fuck, give me the train. How many times you niggas wanna see? I bust one shot like mine. Let a nigga know he shiny flow. He but that stink and never show. Run it up in the attic and my dope still on the stove. Nigga be born in that slow. Shot him in the face on my job. Time in the boy, your nigga gonna die for fucking with my cash flow. Don't fuck with me. I said, don't fuck with me. Me personally, man, um, you know, the bloods, <clears throat> the bloods in prison, for the most part, uh, um, ran things. I would say that. You know what I'm saying? Um, Shouts out to my blood partners. You know what it is. Um, like, the reason I say that, man, and well, I say in coastal state prison, let me say that. Because um, down in Wild Wars, man, um, they rule by numbers. You know what I'm saying? And you have, you know, you know the, the, the blood itself, uh, you know, broken down into, you know, so many different sets, you know, pyro, however. Um, so the organization had, have spread it, like, you know, have spread it. Uh, quickly, um, it's it's easier, you know, down at where I was speaking again. I only can speak for where I was and the people that I was around. It's easier to get inside of um, that gang right now. You know what I'm saying? You, know, you had the the Crips. You know what I'm saying? Shots out to the C partners. Um, you had them down there as well, just like the GDs. You know what I'm saying? Muslims. Everybody had their own different sets. It just when you have numbers like that, man, you, you you gain control. You know what I'm saying? And especially if you um gaining that control by by um force and fear and stuff like that, man. Um down now where I was for as for as the bloods, man, um uh, they, they 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 wipe 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 your nose every day. <laughs> That's what I can say, man. And what I did see that was, you know, unorthodox to me was I seen a lot of them feuding with each other more than other gangs. That right there, it, it, it was hard for me to understand, man. Um, as my time on the in the prison, man, as my time down there, man, um, like, I, yeah. At work, I worked in the kitchen. I was um, lead sanitation. So I was able to float around the prison. I just, I wasn't stationed in that satellite kitchen. You know what I'm saying? I was able to move through the prison um, to each one of the dining halls. We had three dining halls. So with me being sanitation, I got to take garbage cans. I got to bring more food over there. I ran out of food. Things of that nature right now. So the, the um, COs, the guards, they knew my job knew what I was doing, knew who I was. So I was, you know, they're open the gate. Hey, I got to go up here. I got to go up here. I'm going to take this up here. I'm going to take this like that. So I was, you know, I moved around a lot. So I seen and dealt with all the sets. You know what I'm saying? So I got partners in every set. You know what I'm saying? Uh, the, the, the thing is, a lot of, a lot of things that took place that I seen, like I just said, was about, them feuding with each other. Now, when I say feuding with each other, it was it'll be mostly like you'll have you no know, the you know the slime right here, and you have Pyru. You know what I'm saying? And it'll be them, not within their own, but within their own individual sets. You know what I'm saying? Like these set of blood Pyru are going against these blood. Something that happened, you know, in the chain of command. And, and things of that nature right now. Um, with with me being able to move around the whole prison, like I said, I dealt with a lot of different, you know, the different games. The the, the Crips, man, you know, like, you know, I got Pockets Way and Compton, you know, big shots out to BG, BG Nation. Y'all make sure y'all follow BG Nation, BG Knockout from Roof of the Rappers up there in Compton, man. Um, but they was more calm. In the prison where I wore the Crips. They was more on taking care of their 
owns and makes sure everything flows in line. Even if they had to deal with the GDs, even if they had to uh, deal with the Bloods. You know what I'm saying? But they just they just moved a little different. You know what I'm saying? Than uh, my Blood homies. My Blood homies, they was they was all over the place. You gonna hear them? You, too much. You gonna hear the Crips in the prison where I was. You go, you go, you go, you you go hear the calls all the time. You know what I'm saying? Um, the handshakes, you know, um, broad daylight, you know, um, the, the, the correction officers looking, you know, they they can tell who in, who ain't, who you know, things of that nature. Um, I, you know, to me that's that's a you know a dead giveaway. You know what I'm saying? I you know I always thought that not saying anything wrong with how anybody do their thing, but I always thought that like the game life moved like kind of silent. You know what I'm saying? But to each his own. You know what I'm saying? Um. Now, now, so for as some of the actions and 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 things of that nature, with me working in the kitchen, I work. With mostly GDs, big shots out to my GD homies, and um, my Cripsters. Y'all know that I said my. <laughs> and my Cripsters, man. Um, that's every day for, you know, the five to six, whatever, how many hours I'm with the GDs, I'm with the Crips. We handling bid, we get money, we eating. That's what I did on a daily basis. At the end of that day, I went home. To my dorm, to my dorm, straight red. You know, so you had a few um, um, GDs in there. Uh, you didn't have, you didn't have no crip. You know, there was, and then I, they put me in the worst dorm in the prison. You know what I'm saying? K building, K and J. What's up, Coast State Prison? K and J. Then was the worst uh, part in the prison, and I end up going to K. No crips, GD. I don't even think no Muslims in there, man, because they weren't tolerating. <laughs> they weren't tolerating, man, but it was blooded out. You know what I'm saying? And uh, I remember I remember walking into my little homie's room, and it was like three of them in there. And they was, they was looking at, um, they was looking at, excuse me, y'all. They was looking at, um, they had a phone, and they was looking at um, some of their blood partners um, 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 clean somebody's nose. You know what I'm saying? Wipe somebody's nose, whatever. And as they, you know, I hear it. Oh, they, they, boom, I hear it, I hear it. So I walk over there toward them, you know. They in like, you know, the little corner of the room with, you know, edge of the bed, standing up, looking at the phone. So I go over there toward them. I'm like, boy, let me see that, boy. Who, 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 who getting beat down? Let me see. And when I go, you know, try to look, they turned it away from me. Like, no, no, no. Hey, OG, you can't see this, bro. So I'm like, why? And they would let me know because, I, you know, I ain't down with them. You know what I'm saying? And they were telling me if they let me see it, they would have to jump me in. I said, y'all don't have to do what? <laughs> they said, we had to jump you in right now, man. We had to give you a beat down. You know, like, you, know, you want to look at it, you can look at it, though, man. But I thought you, you know, with Crips you know, and shit like that. So I'm like, man, let me tell y'all something, man. They real talk, you know, y'all my little homies, bro. You know, we, we, we eat break bread every day. You know what I'm saying? I need to be hungry, whatever, y'all. Yeah. But, whatever. I said, but let me tell y'all something. Looking at that or any other incident that may occur, if y'all ever put y'all hands on me, jump on me, whatever y'all want to call it, bro, and they don't have to take me out of here, life flight me or take me up, I however, I said, boy, I'm not going to knock on that door. I'm not going to hit that button. And tell them folk come get me up out of him. I said, I'm going to stay here, man. And I'm going to heal up. I'm going to Wolverine up. And every last one of y'all who put their hands on me, boy, I'm coming to see y'all one by one. And I said, exactly that way. Meaning like, after I'm right, I'm going to come over there to the first dude, sale. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to demolish him to my to my. When I say demolish them, you know how y'all want to get on top and just beat, beat them like that. Say, I ain't going to do that. I'm just going to probably just get my thumb and just stick it through your, your eye. Through your eyeball while I'm choking. And then I'm going back to my cell. 
The other two, three, they they can come back in there. No idea. They can come and jump in. And they don't see me at. I'm going to stay right now. And like I said, I told them to get each and every last one on. But them folks forgot about the video. <laughs> they just... <laughs> For real. Them <laughs> folks looking at me crazy. They don't forgot about what they looking at. You know what I'm saying? Um... On one incident, man, I tried to save this white guy, man. He actually, he actually put the A, he tattooed the A on my hand right there when I was down there, man. Uh, his name was Drew. What's up, Drew? But um, I remember, man, I was just walking down the hallway, man. Remember I told you, man, I, I slept with the bloods every day. And um, in the same dorm was like, it was full of, full of blood. But I remember walking down the hallway, and I could hear... Like, you know, commotion. So I go go on right into the, to the cell. It's Drew, it's Drew cell, the white boy. When I get right there, it's probably like nine or ten bloods. And then you got like two on that just enter the room. So I make my way through. Them. Hold on, hold on. You know, I wear respect. They straight OG. You know what I'm saying? I walk through there. Hold on, y'all. Hold, hold, hold on, what's going on, man? What's going on? And then I get inside and I see like, you know, you know Two, the, the other two bloods that came in the room, they don't took their shirts off. White boy like, no, nah, man, he trying to explain himself. So I just said, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, man. And I just get in between uh, the white boy and the two bloods. I was like, hey, bro, listen, we, we just going to kill it, bro. Like, we ain't going to do it this time, man. We ain't like that. And I really just tried to dissolve the situation, man. But but the big blood, his name, my big homie, Pat, you know, he, of course, he's younger than me, but I said big homie because he about six two six three. Way by like two ninety. Uh, what's up, Pat? Out there in Columbia, Georgia, man. How let me I just tried I tried to call you out two weeks ago, man. And the number done changed on me, bro. Hope he ain't in no trouble, man. How let me? But um Pat, man, he was big blood, man. You know, down there ran um the dorm I was in. Yeah, he actually he did. You know, he, he ran the dorm I was in. He was a subtle person though, so it went like he was just mean, muscle and you know, king this and I'm the king. But uh, he had a lot of movement going on too, you know, some cigarette, weed, little stuff like that right now. But he was big blood, you know what I'm saying? And when I stopped the two young dudes from doing it, they walking back out the room, then big blood came in the room. Like just, I remember him coming through the crowd, boom. Came in, I'm like, hey, 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 OG, man, listen, they got to get him, bro. So like, man, just come on out, man. They, they, they listen, bro, they got to get him. You might as well just go and get it over with like right now. And the way he said it to me, man, I, I knew what it was. You know what I'm saying? He was like, OG, man, get out of the way, man. You know what I'm saying? We finna whoop this ninja. You know, I am. And, man, I, I, man, I, I hated it so bad, man, because I remember leaving out the room. As I'm leaving out the room, I just stopped at the door. And I keep in mind, it's probably about 10 bloods right there in the door in a little small hallway, no? You know, in prison. Man, I stopped at the door, man. I looked it all on, man. And they just like... Boy, time you move. <laughs> time you move. Go on, OG. Man, I just took like two more steps, man. Same two boy. Rushed up in there. Man, I turned around, man. They were beating them, bro. Bad, man, I had to sit down and just and watch it, man. For real, like everybody there. Just sit down and watch it, man. Home, home, they ain't try to fight better than that. He just balled up and folded, man. They just did it to him, bro. For real, man. And then it was then just like that. It was over with, man. You know what I'm saying? Everybody walked back to their room. Probably about 30 minutes later, I walked back around. And I know he, he tended to his wounds and stuff. And, and, and you know, it, it, it wasn't like he was missing teeth and, you know, all that. But, you know, he was bloody. He was bloody, bloody, man. You know what I'm saying? But I made sure he was all right, man. And, uh, and man, gave him a little something to eat, man. man, man you know, food always make you feel better after the ad was. <laughs> That's what they say. I don't know. <laughs> hey, man, thank y'all for tuning in to another great episode of Underground Source TV with your host, TV and film producer, Dantrese Knox. Y'all know the stage name, OG Black Boy, 3700, man. Y'all check out my YouTube shots, man. Y'all go ahead and get y'all y'all state sh stand-up shirts, man. You know, just check it out, YouTube shots, man. Y'all make sure y'all share, like, subscribe to this page, man. Y'all tell a friend about this page. It's going down right here, man. And, of course, like I say, I just opened up booking for myself 
on my perks, man. Hey, man, y'all check it out. It, it's, it's like, what, $199, $200 for the whole month. You can book me for the whole month, man. I come out to your events, all that stuff, man. But I got some great perks. I probably got the best perks on YouTube, man. So y'all make sure y'all check out my perks on my memberships. Y'all make sure y'all like and subscribe to this channel, man. It's going down. College Park, stand up. And that fame little side bitch, I had to let that bitch go. Never forget the things I said you in them dead or in the bed. Go fuck around with OG, you get that break go through your head. Don't, don't fuck with me. I said don't fuck with trees. Nigga wanna, 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 nigga wanna. They wanna fuck with me, they fuck with me, they fuck with the best I'm the nigga that shot your ass and burnt down your whole ass How you gonna get your lie back, he shot him with a pump Everybody know his face